Former Wimbledon champion Marion Bartoli has shared her thoughts on Novak Djokovic's upsetting experience with anti-doping officials at the 2023 Davis Cup Finals. Djokovic was required to undergo blood and urine tests before his singles match against Cameron Nori on November 23rd in the quarterfinal of the Davis Cup. The decision clearly upset Djokovic, who was in the middle of his pre-match routine some 90 minutes before he went to the court. Djokovic did not refuse to provide the requested samples, contrary to some outlandish reporting by journalists, and cooperated to do so after the match. The ITIA clarified this in a statement reported by El Equip, saying that the Serb followed all protocols and never refused to do the test. When you know you're going to have a doping test, you have someone following you all day. As soon as you leave the court, he follows you. He's in the locker room when you take your shower. And if you cannot go to the bathroom, he accompanies you to a press conference until you can urinate. Bartoli as quoted in We Love Tennis. According to Bartoli, there is no difference to whether the sample is taken before or after the match. So I do not see what difference it makes whether it is done before or after, especially since after the matches the urinary concentration is greater because during the match there is a dehydration effect. The trial that we tried to do against Djokovic is linked to this British press which knows nothing and which allows itself to accuse the players. It is disgusting, it's shameful and completely unjustified.